Um, General McKenzie. Jennifer Griffin, Fox News. Can you say, was there one or two suicide bombers at the Abbey Gate? And can you say for certain that it was a male bomber? And can you give us any more details about the second explosion that occurred at Barron Hotel? Was that a VBID? Was that a car bomb? Or was that also a suicide bomber? Um, finally, the, there are State Department employees who are side by side with U.S. Marines at that gate. Were there any other U.S. citizens killed in the attack? And why were the Marines so close together that so many were killed in one, one strike? So we think one suicide bomb at Abbey Gate, uh, don't know if it's male or female, just don't have that information. Um, uh, don't uh, don't know much about the second bomb except one went off in the vicinity of the Barron Hotel, which is you're, you're aware is a deeply bunkered structure. And as far as I know, no, there were no UK military casualties as a result of that. There may have been Afghan casualties, and I'm sure there were Afghan casualties. But it will take us a little bit of time to actually learn how many Afghans became casualties. Uh, we took some of them on board the installation. Many of them were taken to hospitals out in town. So I'm, what I see is what I what I get on open source reporting uh, about the nature of those casualties. But we're 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 trying to gather more information about it. So the last point, uh, I would tell you, I don't know that I don't know the size of the bomb, and the size of the bomb is directly related to how many people are are, are going to be affected by the blast radius of the weapon. I, I and so I we are going to investigate that. I, as I've noted before. You're at the interface point there at these gates. Somebody's actually got to look someone else in the eyes and decide that they're ready to come in. And so we'll find out what, exactly what happened. But beyond that, I would not want to speculate at this time, Jennifer. Thank you. Any other American citizens from the State Department who were killed? None that I am aware of now. Okay, I need to go back to the phones. Uh, Laura Seligman. 